in this video I'll be showing you how to insert the rubber into the armor like I promised you in my last video on uh, tutorial number two on plating so assuming you have done all the other things this is what we'll be doing now now this is the armor the full length is about 20 inches half of it is uh, around 10 inches so this is a rubber band I've cut out already and uh, we'll be inserting it into the ammo uh, this one here if you want to know more about how to do this one you go back to watch uh, tutorial number two on plating the arms and the bodies okay can use only one pin I used to I just use the other one as a stopper and um, use the other one to insert it through the central part of the, the hammer This shouldn't take you more than a minute. It's very easy once you know how to do it. Okay, that's about it. Because you see, like I said, I use this one as the stopper. So when it gets to the end, it, the rubber it doesn't pull the rubber right through. So I have this one here that I will have to pull the out, pull the edges out. That's the other one. Align them like that, and I will have to basically shoot, stitch it together, and you will have a nice ammo. With a complete rubber band. Off. all right the final outcome of the sewing would look something like this after you have done the edges remove the excess threads and stuff and they should fit nicely to anyone who's wearing it this one's for young girls So that's about it. Please do subscribe to our channel, like and comment if you need anything or if you want more of it so we can respond by producing more videos for you and for your liking. Thank you.